the Hampton community is still thinking about four-year-old Cody. People spoke about the missing boy at the city council meeting. Sarah Hammond was there and tells us why they aren't giving up hope yet. During the last Hampton City Council meeting, tensions were high over the disappearance of Cody Bigsby. This is what you call a distraction. Don't touch me, but Wednesday night, those activists apologized for their behavior. However, they still aired their concerns and frustrations over the search to the mayor and council. You might think that we're just talking heads. We've covered hundreds of miles of walking, talking with residents, passing out flyers. Mahogany Jones says while she and other community members search for the missing four year old, they're hungry for more information from officials. We believe that there is a huge disconnect between officials, the community and law, law enforcement. Amanda Kelly approached the podium and asked why more cities aren't involved. There's a missing child out there. There should be more cities that are involved other than the city of Hampton. On the other hand, Mary Thompson applauded police chief Mark Talbot and his team for the work they've done to find Cody. She says she was part of the 50 people selected to search with officers just days after he was reported missing. Oh, the chief ain't doing this. The chief ain't doing that. They ain't doing their job. Oh, so well, hell be it. I think they're doing a good job. I watched that chief get tears in his ass. Thompson told the crowd this case hits close to home for her because she lost two children of her own around Thanksgiving. And she says she is extremely passionate about Cody's case. This child means a lot to me like it's my child. Based on this meeting and continuous social media posts, it's clear Cody is still in the hearts and minds of people here in Hampton Roads, even as we approach a month of searching. In Hampton, Sarah Hammond, 13 News Now. Hampton police are still pleading with the public. If you know anything about where Cody could be, if you've seen him or the Bigsby family since Thanksgiving, or if you have surveillance video at the Buckrow Point Apartments, call police. The number is right there at the bottom of your screen, 757-727-6111.